Hello everyone. Welcome back. Today, we're diving into a fascinating topic, what it feels like to hallucinate according to psychology. Hallucinations are unique perceptual experiences that can be triggered by various factors, including mental health conditions, substance use, or even sleep deprivation. So, let's explore what it's like to have a hallucination. Before we get into the feelings, let's briefly define hallucinations. According to psychology, hallucinations are when someone perceives something that isn't actually there. They can affect any of our senses, sight, sound, taste, touch, or smell. First, let's talk about visual hallucinations. When someone experiences this, they may see things that others don't. It can feel incredibly real, like an object or a person is right in front of them, even though it's not. Next, we have auditory hallucinations. These involve hearing sounds, voices, or noises that others can't. It might sound as if someone is speaking to you, which can be very unsettling. Tactile hallucinations involve feeling things on your skin or body that aren't there, such as insects crawling on you. Other sensory hallucinations can also occur, like strange tastes or smells. Beyond the sensory experience, hallucinations often evoke strong emotions. Many people report feeling confused, frightened, or even paranoid during a hallucination. It can be extremely distressing. One key element is the distortion of reality. During a hallucination, it's challenging to differentiate between what's real and what's not. This can lead to a sense of detachment from the real world. Hallucinations are complex and deeply subjective experiences. They can vary greatly from person to person and can be caused by a range of factors. Understanding what it feels like to hallucinate is crucial for mental health professionals, as it helps in providing support and treatment to those who may be going through these experiences. That's all for today's video on the experience of hallucinations from a psychological perspective. If you found this information interesting, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more thought-provoking content. And as always, please remember to be empathetic and understanding towards those who may be dealing with hallucinations. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.